Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Dr. Nzube Eboluche. Today we'll be discussing on a very important question that has been limiting so many people from advancing in their academic career. So join me in this short video in order to gain more information on how you can use your HND, which is the Higher Dip National Diploma, to obtain a master's or PhD admission in the US. First of all, some people think that, you know, because they have HND, they cannot actually get admitted into any US university or even Canadian university. First thing that you have to do is to go through the um, admission requirement of any school that you want to apply to. When you look closely to the admission requirements, you will see where it is mentioned that for you to obtain a master's or to even apply for a master's or doctoral program in the US, in any US university, you need to have a bachelor's degree or equivalent degree. You need to pay attention to that. So you that have an HND, you fall into that category of equivalent degree because your HND is equivalent to a bachelor's degree. So I will tell you at this point that you are not stuck with your HND degree. You can basically use it to obtain a master's or PhD admission in the US. Secondly, another admission requirement is that you, your degree must have been obtained from an accredited university. So you make sure that you graduated from an accredited university from, from the country you're coming from. And if you have your HND, you can basically use it to apply for master's or PhD in the US, right? So what happens, what you need to do is that most of these schools require that you that your transcript has to be evaluated by evalu a transcript evaluation agency. And one of these agency mostly used by most universities in the US is World Education Service, which is called WES, right? So you submit your transcript um, to WES to evaluate that transcript. So WES is their responsibility to officially state that your HND is equivalent to a bachelor's degree. And how is that measured? It's basically based on the total credit hours you have accumulated over the years of obtaining your HND diploma. So what does that tell you? That you are eligible to apply for a master's or a PhD program in the US with your HND diploma. So when you do your West evaluation, you've gotten the school that you decide to apply to. The next thing that you need to do is to make sure that your application materials, such as your um, statement of purpose, your resume, everything is well packaged and up to standard because there are other applicants from all over the world applying to that same program and to that school. Finally, you have to dot your I's, cross your T's, make sure that you have all the requirements for you to obtain admission into the program and into the school that you applied to. Here, here is a list of few list of schools. There are many more. These are just schools that I know that have accepted students with HND into their program. This can be very useful for you. You can start your search from this school to see if they offer the courses that you really want to study. And there are many more schools that really accept HND diplomas in order to do a master's or a PhD program in the US. The US. If you have any question regarding the application process to secure admission offers in any university, in any U.S. university, leave your comment below, ask your question, send an email, and I will get back to you with any information that you need 
Please like and share this video with your friends and network who will really need this information through their application process. And I'm always here to help you through your study abroad process. Subscribe to my channel, turn on your notification to know when I upload a new video that will help you in your study abroad journey. And I will see you in my next video.